Thank you for watching, liking, commenting, sharing, and subscribing right now. Hello everyone, my name is Marcus Brownlee, and welcome to another screencast for youtube.com slash LockerGnome and LockerGnome.com. Now I haven't made a screencast for LockerGnome in a little while, and this one is relatively brief, but hopefully there will be more in-depth tutorials in the future. Either way, let's just get right into this one. Now I'm guessing that most of the geeks in the community already know that Internet Explorer is probably the most outdated internet browser you could possibly use and is constantly losing market share to other web browsers such as Chrome and Firefox. So today I'm going to be showing you how to replace Internet Explorer and actually remove it completely from your system if you're trying to keep a completely smooth clean interface and completely clean computer. So today as I previously stated I'll be showing you how to completely remove Internet Explorer from your Windows 7 system and it's actually quite simple. Let's have a look. In order to start, visit the control panel of your machine, and once there, hit the Programs button. Once you're here, you're going to notice a button near the top that says Turn Windows Features On and Off, and this will bring you to a dialog box that will allow you to do just that. Now you notice that there is a long list of things in this box, which I'll get to some of them later, but the thing you want to concentrate on is that Internet Explorer box. Simply uncheck and you'll fully remove Internet Explorer 8 from your machine. The rest of these things in the box, some of them can be considered unnecessary too. For example, if you're not on a tablet, you can uncheck the tablet features and etc. And this will all keep your machine running relatively fast. Once you're done, just hit OK and you fully removed IE from your machine and you're totally ready to go with your newest internet browser. So thanks for watching this very brief tutorial from MKBHD for youtube.com slash LockerGnome. And if you'd like to find the rest of my work, you can visit likely the link in the description at youtube.com slash Marcus Brownlee. Anyway, nice talking to you guys. Hope to talk to you guys later. Thanks for watching. Peace.